Hi guys, good morning. So I was cooking but I have to pause because this came in today. Yeah, I think it's the red one. Nice! And it also came with an instruction manual. So this is made out of ABS plastic. This is how it looks like. Check out the quality. It looks nice for its price and uh, it has the same color as my bike. This too is made out of high quality plastic. Check it out. This is made out of steel and it's powder coated. Check it out. So all in all, for its price, the materials are okay. Basically, you'd be needing three types of Allen wrench. Number three. Number five. And number six. It's gonna be very easy to install because it has provisions. So you just have to attach them this and like this check out the washer this is a 20 millimeter washer there's another one and this is the 16 millimeter screw we'll use the number three Allen wrench for this. By the way, there are two types of brackets. The one that looks like this is for the right fairing, the right side of the bike. And this is how the bracket on the left looks like. It has this part. For the next step, you'll have to install the left bracket first before installing the right bracket because the right bracket will be directly installed on the bike first before installing the fairing okay going down now so check it out look at the color it matches right perfect this is how the left fairing looks like it has this part this and this so you have to attach the bracket like this you have to attach the washers like this and then attach them to the fairing this is how it looks like when all the screws and washers are attached to the bracket and the fairing this is for the left fairing you have to do the left fairing first before the right fairing because the right bracket will be directly installed to the bike first before attaching the fairing you have to attach the right bracket here this is the provision for the screw and you have to take this off but in order to take that off you must have this special flower key the t50 flower key in order to take off this screw so this is quite difficult to take off always remember when you're uh, unscrewing bolts you have to unscrew them counterclockwise Ah, finally the belly pan actually came with a screw but I'm not sure if I'm gonna use this or we'll just use the stock screw the 
bolts are now tight it's time to attach the belly pan so I connected the right bracket first so guys I've got two more screws and I'm done this is the left part but I guess it would be easier if I have a center stand <sighs> this is the tricky part So that's it. The belly pan is now installed. Let's check it out. Guys, thanks for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe. Rock and roll!